We are on our way to Yuklulet to see the wide open Pacific Ocean. Yeah, we've got some hiking planned. They've got some amazing beaches we're right here and lots of wildlife too. We're going on a whale watching tour. We are here at the Taylor okay. River Rest Area and it's a popular yeah. little swimming mm -hmm. hole on the way to uh, Tofino and Uclulet. And uh, we just watched someone there. jump off this ledge right down into there. <laughs> I'm thinking I might have to try it. Is Mel gonna jump? Let's find out. <laughs> you ready? All right, Mel's going for it. Does that scarier now that I'm on the edge? Well, yeah. Nicely done! It's freezing! <laughs> it should have been like Calabunga or something. <laughs> I have like an instant headache. That cold? My, like brain freeze. Oh, it was fun though. It's not warm. Oh, I should have cannonballed. All right, go for it. Okay, this feels really high. Just go. <laughs> Do a cannonball. Not a cannonball. Well, that was really cool. That is a must stop on the way to Euclidolet and Tofino. Yes. Be prepared though. The water is really, really cold. Oh no, it's, it's like bath water. So we're having a bit of a, a rough journey. Poor Benny. He's been sick in the car twice now. I tried to give him gravel, but it just wasn't enough, I don't think. Maybe you didn't get into him fast enough. The roads are really windy. Poor little guy. This is a monstrous plant. It's quite a bit taller than I am. Well, good morning. We are here at the beginning of the lighthouse loop of the Wild Pacific Trail. Yes, we're starting this one and a half kilometer-ish trail at the Amphrotite Lighthouse right behind us. So while you're walking along the Wild Pacific Trail here at the Lighthouse Loop, a few wildlife things to keep your eyes peeled for on the coastline. Some of the common ones are harbor seals, uh, stellar sea lions, and killer whales. The ones that you might see more seasonally, that's the California sea lions, the gray whales, and the humpback whales. Here's a little tide pool. I can see the tide just slowly rolling in and there's some little fish in the water. This trail is nice because it's got some bright sunny open areas where you can go tide pooling and then you can get out of the sun and come into the forest, cool off just a little bit. So here in Yuklulet, you've got to be aware of earthquakes and tsunamis. There's tons of signage actually around and there are different safety points that are believed to be high up enough. If there is a tsunami warning, they encourage everyone to leave the risk zones to the safety points. Most of Yuklulet is in the red zone. <laughs> 
and, and we we're like right somewhere in, around there. Thankfully, yep. though, we don't have too far. We can just pop up Nora Road here if there was an issue. So we kept hearing an odd low sound. Didn't know what it was. Apparently, it's the whistle buoy which has been here since 1905. Uh, wave action creates the unique sound using air pressure, so the buoy is loudest in rough seas. Some hot dogs. We're looking through all the different options. They got some really cool ones like mac and cheese, Korean. I think I'm gonna get the spicy Mexican dog. I'm kind of intrigued by this mac and cheese dog. Jay loves hot dogs when we go camping and it's like a must. And so when I found this place, it was kind of a we've got to go and check this out. And when we visited Chile, there they had all sorts of like crazy hot dogs with crazy toppings. So this seems like very simple. Yeah. I got the mac and cheese dog and the bun. Actually it looks like a pretzel bun. It looks really good. I got the spicy Mexican here. You can see that. Yep. Yeah. I'm not going to look some eyes. Let's dig in. We've just arrived at the other end of the Wild Pacific Trail at the Ancient Cedars Loop. Now that's a big tree. So I think this tree is multiple trees that grew into one. I think it's one tree. What do you think? Let us know in the comments below. It's one tree. So we're on the other side of the uh, Wild Pacific Trail here, and this is the longer section. It's a couple more kilometers. I think it's about four kilometers long. Um, it's really, really nice. There's some ups and some downs, and lots and lots of lookout points, just like around the lighthouse area. It's really beautiful. Love walking around here. Um, this side we've noticed actually has been a lot less trafficked than the lighthouse loop. So if you're looking to get away from the crowds, this might be the trail to be on. So we're back on the Pacific, Wild Pacific Trail to, ca whew, to catch the sunset. <laughs> and we ran here because we totally underestimated the distance from the parking lot to the viewing platforms where you can actually see the sun. But uh, yeah, we're here now. We made it in time. And just check out this gorgeous sunset. All right, guys, our adventures in Yuklula here are continuing. This morning, we're donning these big safety suits for out on the water and we're gonna go see some whales. Fingers crossed. to find them like in all these waves yeah. it's really hard to find them there she is wow that's so cool oh, there's no tail oh yeah okay I turned the camera off Mm-hmm. 
on a sub too as well. Yeah. There's like the low and slow. Oh, oh there goes the tail. Oh. All right, guys, before we wrap up, I just wanted to do the draw for the Nanaimo Bar postcards. So let's cue the first winner. Congratulations, Paul. Send us an email. Um, we'll put our email information at the bottom, but it's contact at homearome.com and we will send you that postcard. Now let's see who's the next lucky winner. Congratulations, Carol. I know you comment on like every single one of our videos. I'm so happy that you won this one. And uh, again, just like with Paul, send us an email with your information and we will mail you that postcard with the Nanaimo bar recipe. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye. We are on our way to La Cluelet. La, La Cluelet. <laughs> you Cluelet. Yep. You Cluelet. We're on our way to Yaklulet, home of the... No, I don't want to say home of the... Ooh, look so, at my hair. Fix that. <laughs> and really nice. There's some ups. Oops, you chopped my head off. Now you are. Now we are. Okay. <laughs> I hope you got that tail. Did you get that? I hope so. <laughs> I was recording. I was pointed in the general direction. Make sure you don't miss the next video by liking, subscribing, and turning on notifications. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you in the next one.